Bonjour, welcome to Fresh Fishing. We know you've been eagerly awaiting the France trip and we're happy to say it's finally here. Last year, we took our first carp fishing trip to France and it did not disappoint. We had the weather, plenty of beer, and we all smashed some PBs. Similarly to last year, we booked this year's trip with Angling Lines. They offered us a great price and helped us with ferry bookings as well. Before we get into the vlog, for anyone new to the channel, go and smash that subscribe button before getting comfy. Now let's take a look at the venue we'd be fishing for the next seven days. Villa Fond is a big fish water situated in Western France around a six hour drive from Calais. The lake is around 8 acres in size and usually has depths of 14 foot but due to extensive heat over the summer the lake has lost a good amount of water. There is an island to fish up to and the margins are known to produce. There are 180 carp present in the lake which go up to a massive 80 pound along with one catfish and three grass carp. The facilities are basic with use of a mobile home. There's a small shower block and toilet which is all solar powered. There are eight pegs on the lake so between five of us we'd have room to move if needed. Now the scene is set, let's get on with proceedings. Enjoy part one of France 2022. <laughs> we are on the road, baby. We are. You all right back there? Yep. I wonder if it's, uh, I wonder if it's weird for the subscribers to see me drive. I was about to say. This isn't right, is it? <laughs> Say. Just a quick one to say we are on the way. Yes, we are. This man's driving for once. He's doing some driving whilst we're in the UK, and then me and Dad are going to take over. Oh no, me and Dad are going to take over when we get uh, into France. But we've got a long old journey. How many miles, Dad? 700? 722. 722 miles in total. We are heading down to Dartford first. We're going to pick up Jay. Max is in. The other van. Have a little word. Come in, Max. Come in. <laughs> Thank you very much for that. There he is. So we've got one of these little CBs in between the vans. Are you recording? <laughs> I hope there's no swearing. <laughs> there's never swearing on this channel. Just beeping. Beep. Yeah. So we've got these little CBs so we can communicate whilst we're driving in convoy. And yeah, next stop, well, we'll probably be stopping for some food in a little bit. Uh, and then after that, it'll be down to Dartford to pick Jay up. And then over to the to the ferry. So a long old trip. A very, very long old trip. Probably not much sleep. But whoever's in, like, passenger in the back can, can obviously sleep. Um, but yeah, looking forward to it. Villa Fond, here we come. Buzzing. <laughs> Taking my cheese out. Don't film it. Dinner time. Mm -hmm. 
over Eps. We're going over Eps, lad. Wait, huh? How are you getting up, driver? Yeah, I'm, I'm good, mate. I'm good. Can you keep your eyes on the road, please? <laughs> We've had a couple in there, misses <laughs> We really have. Here he is. Here he is. Hello. Look at the lights on her. She's a, she's a beauty, isn't she? She's a beauty. She's a bloody beauty. Lambo, apparently. It's a Lamborghini. Oh, Lamborghini. Get that bad boy on. Oh, look at that. Just getting my cosy on. <sighs> it's not cosy. Right now, we are currently just sat waiting. Our ferry is at 10 past 3. We start loading at 2.30. And what time is it now? It's 1 o'clock, just coming up. <clears throat> 5 to 1. So, this is We've still got an hour and a half. Very tiring, and I can't sleep. Eventually. Tired. Do I look tired? Because I feel like I look tired. No, you don't, actually. That so, that was like rocket science trying to do that. That, that was terrible. Well, it was realising where to put the car in first. That was absolutely For the first refuel. Did we go down did, did we go down to an empty tank? Huh? Did we go no. down to like nearly a mile, wasn't it? About hundred mile left. Oh, okay. Morning, I'm Jamie. I'm Kitch. Welcome to Fresh Fishing 2.0. Oi, oi, it's Just giving you a quick update. We're en route to uh, Billy Fond. And uh, hopefully going to catch a few whackers, what do you reckon? Let's go get some cap and punch with this! Right, I'm in my little hobbit hole in the back of the van. And uh, we are, we are, what, under 50 miles away? Uh, Dad. 2.4 2 miles yet, but you're just going straight over at the roundabout. Yeah, so we're 45 miles away from our final destination, and uh, it has been an absolute slog. And it's going to be more of a slog when we get there as well, because we're going to have setting up to do and pegs to choose and all that. But I think on the way there, we are going to stop at a shop, get some bevs, some crisps, some snacks, and then get over there. So, we'll see you soon, probably at the supermarket first, and then at the venue. Wow, the shop's been done. There it is. We found the shittest Aldi, no man, but we managed to get what We've we got needed. got beer, and now, let's fish. Let's go. Let's go. So what are we thinking then? I'm thinking, can we put the bivy up so I can go to bed? <laughs> yeah, we are tired. Well, I've had a little bit more sleep than you. You have, I've had like 15 minutes. I think I ended up with maybe a couple of hours in total over the... Uh... Martin, what was the duration of that journey? 17. 
17 and hours. Um, <laughs> so at the minute we're kind of we were going to like draw pegs but we're having a, a civilised walk around and conversing about the pegs. See, this isn't going to be good for us. What pegs this? Drawing pegs. Five. This is five, isn't it? Oh. Seven, eight. Yeah, this, this is five, isn't it? Five isn't going to be good for us, Foxy. So, so far, we're looking at four and six. Right, so pegs have been chosen. And we've done it very, very amicably. We are. Um, you know, like adults do. Um, we've actually, yeah, come to like a nice agreement. We've kind of said, look, who wants what? And kind of turned out that, yeah, no one really wanted each other's pegs. So um, me and Foxy have gone on peg six. Jay? Peg seven. Kitch? Peg two. Mark? Three. Peg three. So there you have it. We're going to get the... Um, Get the gear over to the pegs now, and we shall see you when we're up and running. Come on, boys. Tight Come on. A quick bird's eye breakdown of the pegs for you viewers. Jamie would be in peg seven. Kitch in peg two. We've got OMR in peg three. we were jumping in peg six. Second trip about to happen. Huh? Saying second trip about to happen. Let's do it then. It's a slog, man. It's raining. It's a slog. We need to take all that round as well. We're inside the little cabin that we got. Here's the menu for the week. Can I just say something? No. Arsenal, Whoa! Arsenal 3, Tottenham 1. Oh, yeah. Da, 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 I've actually yeah. got my late stuff. I'm going tomorrow. to the toilet, like, so I'll just buy that. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, can I just say something? You know your Leeds ones that you've been wearing, a couple of them? Yeah. We got them from Free Retro, we website did. Free Retro. He hooked us up to wear for summer last year and we didn't even wear them no you please. wore yours i didn't wear mine so i brought them well i've got my yellow one so retro football right. tops free retro mate can't go wrong on on about 30 quid each Get on it. but this is the uh the little cabin that dad's got if he wants to sleep in mine that bed in there isn't that bad that one. it's like a foam mattress yeah yeah but it's just a bit obviously there's no sheets Got like late rolls here, <laughs> supermarket tackle shop if you need it, how to handle monster cart, hopefully we'll be handling them soon, we're just waiting for dinner now, That's and then we're going to get back to the, uh, <laughs> to the pegs and get rods out. Max is just checking out the facilities. Yeah, the facilities are in the room. This is... Foxy's already been in now by the smell of it. I've already ruined the toilet, like... <laughs> God, no, that's not me, that's someone else. Whoa! There's a toilet. There's a shower. Solar powered. Who was in there last? You? Yeah, I, I that him. smells like you. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the young stallion smell. No. And dinner is served. Ruby, chicken ruby. I'm starving now, mate. I don't know. Digging straight in. I ain't waiting around, mate. Hank. Hank. Oh. Update for your peeps. Uh, we're in the bivvies and we've got two rods out each, four rods between us. And they're, yeah, uh, too tired to actually explain everything. So, unless we get into a fish, we'll see in the morning.
Night night. Do you want to say night, Wayne? Night, babe. Night night, babe. We've come to get Monster Cat. <laughs> Look at that, look at the size of that cop. And he's into a monster. I think it's a crucian. It's not, it's a mirror. Oh, is it? Yeah. It's a little tiny mirror. Jesus. Well, well that's not even two pounds, is it? Probably not, no. <laughs> well, we're not going to do a hold-up shot with this one. Definitely not. So, ladies and gents, all this way to France, and Foxy's bagged himself a new PB. Not. Another pounder. Jay had another pounder uh, just before I went to sleep as well. So we're catching them, but it's just not what we want. They were coming, they were coming. We're in. Six in the morning. Get in there. In. Proper fish. Doesn't feel massively big to be fair. He said they might come in easy though. It doesn't feel like. Doesn't feel like. An 80 pound monster, put it that way. Yeah, I didn't put my torch on. Right, I'm just going to stick this on. Look at me just in my underpants. He's <laughs> <laughs> walking, walking about in your pocket. It's quite cold, actually. Oh, Come on. Get in. She's in the net. Get in. This is the only thing. I want to get down there to wet the sleeve and stuff. Oh man. Fish is in the net. We're just getting prepped. Bugs. Now we've got it here, we can see how big it is. Um, it's uh we thought it was just a twenty. Could well be a thirty. There we have it, our first Villa Fond proper cart because we both had a pounder each and we was like, what is going on at this place? And yeah, this one screamed off, six o'clock in the morning, 31 pounder, PB common, can't get wet because it's like 6 a.m. We can't retain the fish, so might have to wet me another time. But Yeah, I'll let him off for now. What a beautiful, beautiful common. Lovely Get stuff, in. well done, mate. Right, watch watch the line for that one as well. <clears throat> Just going back in. We've actually only got three rods out because after we took the take for the little one from me last night, we were like, let's just leave that out. And uh, yeah, we've only got three in. Got it. Off she goes. Off she goes. Just see that. Well done, son. Cheers, pal. Morning, morning. As you can see, big lad. He's just resetting a, a rod. Having a bit of trouble with some little fish, but um, not causing too much trouble. Obviously, as you've seen, we've had a 30 out or 31. Um, so, so far, so good. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Um, so basically, um, if yeah, you're new to the channel, yeah, and you haven't watched us before, when we come away on like kind of big trips, um, it started a few years ago. We basically kind of share the rods, and the reason for that is because you come away for like a week to France, you pay all this money, and then one of you might catch a load, and the other one goes home upset and not not getting anything. So <laughs> crying. The idea is to um, just to share the love, really. Yeah. Uh, and we can't, we we literally. I just said to Wayne before. I was like, we haven't actually discussed it. We have literally just turned up. It's normal, it's out normal it's just, for us now. We're so used to doing it. Mm. That's just what like we're jumping and swimming together. And mm. but if we're on like a you know a twenty four hour or even a forty eight hour at some places, some venues, if we can't get on a double swim, then obviously yeah, we'll you know we'll do yeah, our, we we'll do, do our, our own thing. thing. But. Uh, it's yeah. just more when we come away and, and do these big trips and then and as you say we can get like a double so this, this technically isn't a double but it, it is when you look at the space mm. and the way that the the lads are spaced around the lake we've actually got a lot of water we've got to play so with. much water to play with so. i hope none of them decide to move during the week 
Um, hopefully they have it off in their swims and they stay well away from us. <laughs> but um, yeah, so since that fish we, we had, uh, um, was it six o'clock or something? Yeah, it's just after six. Um, we pretty much, we went, went back in our bivvies, we stayed awake for a bit. Um, didn't even end up going back to sleep, did we? So no, we just like, chatting between the bivvies. Just had a cup of tea in Foxy's um, humble abode. And um, it's coming up to, what is it, about quarter past eight. So breakfast turns up at about nine, nine. o'clock. So, yeah. Then I think we're going to have a run to the shop at some point as well. We need to get showers, get changed. Yeah, minging, mate. I need to brush my teeth. It's probably been Same. too long since the last time I brushed my teeth. Same. So, yeah. So I think we're going to talk tactics, get Brecky, and we'll see you in a bit. This is Brecky. Nice big baguette, sausages, bacon, egg. Cool. Should be nice. We just pulled the rods out. Heading for a shower. Well, I say we. Don't know where. Don't know where this gadget's at. <sighs> Who knows? Anyway, yeah, heading for a shower, and um, and then we're gonna get changed, and. Then we're going to go and find the shops just to get some snacks and some bits that we need and then we'll be back and we'll be putting the rods back out. So off we go to the shops and um, we're both just showered up. I'm not that impressed to be honest. I'm not that impressed. The water kept going cold on me whilst I was in the shower so I stood out, oiled up in the suds. You know like shower gel in between the crack of my bum. Water. Nice, <laughs> extra clean. Nice. It went cold when he was in the shower. I did. You braved it and just got in. Didn't you? I did. I just did it. Not for me. No, I had to did wait. Did you not hear me screaming? I was going. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. I heard you. Um, but anyway, showered up, uh, and we're on our way to the supermarket just to grab some bits because I think yesterday when we dropped off at the supermarket before we got rush. here, we was a bit hasty. We just kind of picked up water and beer. That was pretty much it. That is the most important thing. To be yeah, you get this side. Um, so yeah, on our way to the supermarket and uh, get back, get those rods back out. Foxy's turn. Yeah, boy. Bosh. We're back. Well, it's just me right now. Foxy's moody with me. <laughs> so obviously we went out to get some grub and that. And you can't get cigarettes in supermarkets. You need to go to a tobacco shop. I wanted some cigarettes. Um, so there was like searching for t tobacco shops. And because it's Sunday... They're like all closed. So I managed to find some, like it looked a bit precarious. Is that a word? Anyway, found it on Google Maps, said 24 hours, but here's Mr. Happy. Uh, <laughs> it said 24 hours, but it didn't even. How many extra miles did we do there? We went to two different places. We, we, we added an extra 40 minutes onto our journey. Easily. Um, Wild goose chase we were on. So we went to one shop. It didn't exist. Went to another shop because it said it was open till 3 p.m. It was closed. It's Sunday, so no cigarettes. But I can go without. Wait till tomorrow. No, Max will give you some anyway. So, but yeah. Foxy's really happy. <laughs> this we are. We are literally one rod away from having them all back out. Them three are out, these two are out, this one's going out now. And? We're Wayne making good use of the old wellies we that we just wellies. purchased. 16 euros. Money well spent. Money very well I'd spent. Say. So yeah, let's get this rod out. Let's catch another fish. Let's catch another fish. And pe people might say, oh, why are you using the boat? Yeah. Well, the reason we're using the boat, two reasons. One, apparently the, the fish here are very spooky. So the... the the least amount of noise noise and commotion you can make the better because there's literally like yeah there's a few small ducks on the lake but for an eight acre lake eight acre lake there's not a lot of wildlife here is there really? no not really and then yeah the other reason is just obviously being able to bait up easily without making that's the noise, main reason spotting really, and all that it? yeah without kind of spotting to get a lot of bait out there all at once yeah so so um quick update from everyone else as well no one else has, has caught anything yet so still one to us yeah um, we are going to try and get them if they get anything we're going to try and get footage of that as well of course 
Right, let's get this out there. Come on. Let's do it. shot the man the myth the legend he's just gonna know the shower clean these balls hopefully in them balls boy hopefully you can get into one oh look it's back it's getting on but he's setting the traps it looks can you see him Oh, that's as much as this can zoom. You can just about make him out in his peg there. I think he might be getting the boat out. Oi, oi. Hey, up, Sean. What are you doing, fella? Game's on. About to watch Leeds, yeah. Nice one. They better win. You look cosy. Yeah, it's nice in there. It's a set up. Need to tidy up, boy. You think? It's Still? Not, it's not like you. Oh, this is tidy. <laughs> I'm going to go and have a beer with Kitch. Alright. Give me a shout when the rods go. I will. Ta ta. Enjoy. Look that. Dinner is served. On a tray and everything. Probably. Get in. Do you know what you're talking about? Dessert, chocolate pudding. Cracking. So Foxy's doing the deeds. We are getting plagued by these little ones. So he's going down there, just getting the hook out the mouth. Bloody cunt. Yeah. Go. It's going to be a nice fish, that like. It's going to be a big one. Yeah. Let me see. Shoulders on that. Let me see. Oh yeah. It's going to be a dinner plate, that, isn't it? Proper. But it's not what we want. No. is somewhere over the other side currently doing a live on YouTube and he's I think he's with Old Man River at the minute so he's somewhere over there so I'm just uh, manning the rods in hope that one of them will scream off and it's uh, it's about 7.30 here now Coming up 8 o'clock and as you can see it's getting dark. Beautiful night to be fair. Hopefully it's going to be a clear night and we'll have some nice stars to gaze. I think now you can see Wayne just walking round. There you go, just coming in shot. So he's just going out to see Kitch now I think. And yeah, it's very quiet at the minute. We did have, um, whilst I was watching the footy, this left hand rod went and it was unfortunately another one of the little tiddlers that's in here. Not what we're after, but um, at least the rigs are working. Are you alright? No. What's the matter? I think we've bought a water thing that goes on like a water cooler. <laughs> <laughs> Why can't you open the lid? Nah, man. No man. Unless I just twist it off. Gonna take the whole thing off. I might have to because he's struggling. Oh, oh, oh! What? You... Oh, oh! Oh, I see. wait, wait, wait! I think I see. So if I put that there, yeah, that is wicked. 
<laughs> that is unbelievable, Jack. <laughs> Look at that. Just want a little bit more water. That's my, decent to be fair. Kettle. So that'll do for the kettle. And then I'll just fill this bottle up here. I'll just fill this one up here. Well done for sussing it out. I'm proud of you. Just watch this one, ready? Oh, that's a little one though. It's gonna work as well. Watch this, ready? Ready? Oh no! Oh. <laughs> I'll get it. I'll get it this time. Ready? Come on, get it in the hole. Bye. That is fantastic. Look at the flow. A long, steady flow. Don't need to go to the doctors. <laughs> like your pieces. Exactly. That well is, done, mate. That is class. <laughs> that is class. So good. Yeah. They're not going to do anything to you. I'm like Batman. I'm scared of them, all right? Do you not know that? He's scared of bats, but he's actually Batman. <laughs> the bats are whizzing in quick, hard and fast. I don't know if you, you probably can't even see it on here. But Foxy's cracking me up. <laughs> <sighs> they're coming like they're coming right to us and then whew, like they're trying to bite us little vampire bats but I told you last night when you was asleep at this exact time I was in my bivvy as if I was asleep at 8 o'clock last night no, looking out and there was tons of them and they looked like they were trying to come in the bivvy and then just whipping up last minute little shitheads oh, I wish I would have just got you on camera two minutes ago I was going to go in my bivvy I was too scared that's hilarious Ooh. Whoa! <laughs> Why are you looking? <laughs> Why are you stood like that? I'm scared, man. <laughs> I'm scared, man. Yeah, man. Yeah. I'm gonna volley one. If it comes close, I'm gonna volley it. <laughs> Boosh! I'm only scared because they got rabies, haven't they? If you get bit by one of them. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm turning into a bat. <laughs> oh! <gasps> Where did that go? That that came from behind us, right through us there. Yeah? What? Yeah. I'm going in my bed. <laughs> it did. I'm not going to lie, it did. I, this, is, this is too much. Are you going in? <laughs> yeah, until there's a fish. To I'm be not... honest, even I'm on my toes a bit now. I've... They are, you are testing my patience. <gasps> what? <laughs> what? That f came right near my head. Did it? Right, I'm going in. Yeah, I'm going in. I'll see you in a bit. Are you keeping the camera, yeah? Turn that off. Yo, what's up? Yo. We just got our little... Got our new little head torches. Head torches. Giving them a whirl. That we got from, what is it? Phoenix. These are class, mate. Phoenix. Phoenix? F-E-N-I-X? F-E-N, yeah. Phoenix, isn't it? Is it? I yeah. thought Phoenix is P-H-E-O. Possibly, yeah, but they're like they're doing it with an F, aren't they? So it's like, like play, like you know, like play on words. Yeah, I think. So this one's a HM fifty R. What's that one? HM sixty R. This one's a little bit smaller. I wanted the smaller one. I want the bigger one. You're lying. I wasn't bothered. Um. We're doing a night message. Yeah. Because what time is it? Uh, it's like quarter past nine, something like that. Quarter past nine. But it's not going to be that long until we're back out here. Hopefully. So. Hopefully. I have had a couple of beeps on the far right rod that's in, in the margin. So maybe that's a good sign. Maybe that's fish in the area. But, mm, but it's been a slow day, hasn't it? Apart from obviously the, you know, the fish that came out at six o'clock this morning. And the tiddlers. <clears throat> obviously. We don't talk about them. Pardon me. Um, but yeah, we've, um, I guess, kind of like over the first kind of day and a bit, we've, I guess we've kind of just been doing a lot of like water watching, really, haven't we? Trying to suss out like yeah. 
like we're we're seeing like the majority of the shows and, and stuff like that. Stuff we like think that. we've got an idea of it, but um, and then tomorrow we're gonna really try and sort of find <clears> spots, find some spots, do a bit and of work on the spots. Yeah, and do a bit of kind of heavy baiting over a couple of spots because we haven't really done any heavy baiting since we've been here. We just wanted to like try and suss things out and just yeah, we've see just how been light, going. lightly baiting, and that's the advice as well, not to chuck a load of baiting. But mm. yeah, we're gonna try and stick to a couple of spots and just bait them up a bit. But <laughs> for now, this is this is good night. This is good night, and we will see you in a bit with a fifty pounder. Yeah, we will. Toodle pip. <clears throat> Ta ta. About. 25 25 13 well 10 just say cool well done mate cheers mate absolutely knackered I am I I literally just started falling asleep and it just sort of a few little beeps and then just tore me down the margin really where was that margin that was off, off the island oh really so uh, we've been told to use back leads didn't and caught. Don't no, no. fish the island. Yeah. And catch. <laughs> Can't pick it up. There she is. Go on, son. First one from Phil of Fond for me. Guess in. 20. What was he saying? 2510. 2510. Cool. Nice one, mate. It's a nice little proper round one, isn't it? Big shoulders. Proper little dinner plate, isn't it? Nice. Get in. Well, Jamie's just giving us a wake up call. And he's got a 29.9. Single grain of uh, purple corn. Is that what it was? Single grain. Purple. What, have you got different colour ones? Uh, I've got two, yeah. Interesting. I've got some green ones actually. Didn't give too much of a fight. <sighs> Didn't expect to be seeing you boys once, let alone twice. I was dead to the world, mate. There we go. Banger. 29. Oh. 29.9. It's class, mate. It's class. Going back in. <sighs> Bit tired. Go tell your mum I want to visit. Well done, mate. Cheers, man. Well, that brings us to an end of part one. It was a tough start to the week with only a few carp being caught, a stark contrast to our 2021 trip, but we were determined to keep going and catch more. Tune in next week to see if we could do that and for a cheeky bots. As always, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. And if you don't already, subscribe to the channel and click the alarm bell to get notifications when we post any new content. Thanks for watching.